As students of Scotch Oakburn College, we take pride in our actions to help protect our planet, and we encourage the politicians to do the same. We've interviewed staff and students from our senior and middle school campuses to ask them, what do they do to help fight climate change? I've just run into Mr Power here. One simple question. What do you do to help fight climate change? Oh, that's a good question. I plant uh, 12 trees per, per annum to offset the carbon emissions of my vehicle. Actually, probably need to prove about 20 trees, considering I drive a diesel car. Yeah, but tree planting is what I've done. Tree planting, very good initiative. Thank you for sharing. No problem. I hope it goes well. What's it about? The question is, what do you do about fighting climate change? Oh. Uh, I don't really know that I do anything. <laughs> well, it could be simple as using a using a glass mug instead of yeah, plastic. So, so environmental sustainability. Um, yeah, I do that, and especially in my area, I um, all of the food scraps that we cook with. We now have a worm farm which is going to be set up, but prior to that, we used to give them to people that had chooks so that they weren't just going to go to waste. Um, when I do my grocery shopping, I don't pick up any vegetables that are wrapped in plastic anymore. Um, and I take my own bags and I don't put them into little individual bags. Yeah, I think Very good. things like that are important. It's the little things that count. Okay, on. okay we're having a courtside interview with the one and only Harry Corbolt. Harry, one quick question, mate. What do you do to help fight climate change? I try to limit as much plastic as I can. And one extra thing I do is whenever I get milk, you know how they've got the seal caps? I always cut them in half because I heard that turtles get stuck there. So, you know, just every day, striving every, to make change. Striving to make change. You heard it here, guys. That was a good answer. Okay, we're here with elite footballer Mia King. Mia, what do you do to help fight climate change? I always use reusable lunch packaging, um, so never any plastics. Okay, we have Theo Wolfhagen here. Theo, what do you do to help fight climate change? Oh, uh, well, on the farm we like to recycle our silage wrapping, which wraps up the hay bales. It helps it ferment, and it's very... Lots and lots of plastic gets used over the winter, so we like to recycle them. We're putting Charlie on the spot here. Charlie, what do you do to help fight climate change, mate? Um, so, uh, I, I ride the bus to school over mornings so that I don't put as many carbon emissions into the air. We've got the one and only Lenny Adams here. Lenny, what do you do to help protect our planet? Reusables. <laughs> Short and sweet. Okay, I'm about to bust into Waste Not What Not meeting. Here we go. Hope it goes well. Hello everyone, sorry to interrupt. Hello. I'm conducting interviews and it's something right up your alley. Sorry? I fight climate change by using recycled materials and metal straws. Yes, that's a very good answer. Who's next? We'll get Dean. Oh. Dean, what do you do to help fight climate change, mate? Well, you know, uh, at our house, recycling, uh, uh, the use of composting and also the recycling of soft plastics is very important in reducing one's own personal impact on the environment. So that is a very good answer. Who's up next? Here we go. We have a FOGO bin at home. FOGO bin, uh, do you want to go into a bit of detail about what that is? So basically you can put all your food scraps into there so it doesn't go into the recycling or general waste bin. Very good idea, yes. Anyone else? Yeah. Yeah. I fight climate change by saving energy. All right, keep it rolling, keep it rolling. I try to limit my electricity use and I try to eat less meat as well. So I only eat meat when I go to restaurants. So most days yeah. I'd say I'm a vegetarian. Catch that one. Oh, nearly got him out. What do you do to help fight climate change? Climate change? I put my rubbish in the bin where it needs to go instead of littering. Claire Munnings here. Claire, what do you do to help fight climate change? I always bring keep cups to school when I have drinks. I have a keep cup. <laughs> I have a keep cup. No. So I... Keep cup? Oh, of course. I've got my keep cups. And speaking of uh, Scotch Open keep cups, where are they available? They're available, I believe, through uh, the uniform shop. And I'm sure if you asked at reception, we'd be able to organise one from uh, the store that we have in the community relations area. 
Okay, fam, what do you do to help fight climate change? I bring my research to school in a container. Mr McKendrick here. Mr McKendrick, what do you do to help fight climate change? Uh, I was just having my lunch, so just using recyclable plastic there. Um, I also pretty pedantic about my recycling and things at home, so try and make sure that I keep everything in the right spots and do all that. So, yeah, yeah we have Olaf here. Olaf, what do you do to help fight climate change, mate? Um, I always fill my water bottle with tap water and I reuse my plastic bottles and then put them in the recycle bin. Ones are reusing and recycling just as much as we are doing in our own homes. Good idea, like for instance, if you're stopping to get a, a milkshake, just don't take the straw, you don't need it because those straws are just one time use and then they're chucked away, they're not recycled. The simple question is, what do you do to help fight climate change, Ethan? Um, we have a compost bin and we do like the um, the recycling bins and all that sort of stuff at home, just all that. I bring nude food to school. I recycle. I recycle and bring nude food to school. <laughs> Turn off lights that I'm not using. Same. I, everything they just said. <laughs> everything, yay, thank you. It seems like the students and staff do their part to help fight climate change. Now we have one simple question for our politicians. What do you do?